So today I will be reviewing George Marsden's book, The Outrageous Idea of Christian Scholarship. So we live in an increasingly secular world. In terms of academic spaces, they are often hostile and dismissive of any system that attempts to place value judgments, like the Christian ethos on history. They favor humanistic ideals instead of the truth and use schools of thought that limit the overarching themes of history. In terms of the Marxist school of historical thought, historians often divide history into the oppressed and the oppressors. Other historians divide history along the lines of race and gender, which limits the nuance that can be given to any historical event. In George Marsden's book, The Outrageous Idea of Christian Scholarship, he makes a case for adding the Christian perspective to the mainstream schools of academic thought. So I think this is a really good idea and I think it would open up the breadth of scholarship even more than it already is. He does a really fine job with discussing the strengths and weaknesses of the Christian perspective in terms of academic scholarship. When I read the book, when strength that I agreed with had to do with the purpose of telling historical narratives. The purpose of doing history, in my opinion, is so that we can use it in the present. By that, I do not mean doing history to push a certain political agenda. Rather, I mean giving the public these narratives so that they can use them to make wise decisions. In essence, historians who use solid evidence to support their claims provide people with the information they need to be truly free. Now, the definition of freedom that I'm using is to make decisions that are worthy of being made, not the, fr not the freedom to do whatever you please. <sighs> Lastly, the Christian perspective allows historians to use Holy Scripture with the truth to place value judgments upon events and people's decisions of the past. Another point I agreed with that Marsden made has to do with the methodological pro approach of atheism in terms of historical analysis. Now, I know when I say this, this is controversial. When historians analyze a culture from the perspective of atheism, we are in a sense denying their culture and reducing their beliefs to a result of natural selection. Thus, in a sense, we are denying an important aspect of what it means to be human, which is religious belief, and having a moral value system to follow. Overall, Marsden presented some interesting points about the idea of including the Christian school of historical thought into the mainstream academia. Again, I believe it would add more nuance to a historical narratives and allow Christian historians to use the value system which they believe in as a way to help others analyze past events and people to make good decisions. <laughs>